Box 1, Introduction and Loops. This activity will introduce you to the Sphero EDU app and get you programming with loops. There are three components to Sphero EDU, robots, programs, and activities. Robots. In our case, robots are connected and programmable toys. Programs. Programs are code that tell the robot what to do. In the block series, you will drag and drop block commands that represent JavaScript code to tell the robots what to do, such as roll, stop, set color, use the sensors, and more. One day, you'll write the JavaScript code all by yourself. Activities. Activities are fun ways to learn and code with Sphero, such as the chariot challenge and light painting. The four main sections of the app are home, programs, activities, and drive. Home. The feed is a real-time hub for Sphero EDU. Scroll through and you'll find trending content, alerts if a user comments on something you've shared, and our at Sphero EDU Twitter feed. Visit the feed every day and see what's new. My Programs. These are the programs you create. You can start a new one with the green plus button. You'll see the option for three types of programs, draw, blocks, and text. You'll be learning with blocks today. You also need to select with which robot or robots you want to program. Let's use Sphero. Selecting other robots enables robot-specific commands in the block canvas. Sphero programs. Check out these programs created by the Sphero team. There are many unique examples, games, and quick lessons for your robot here. We publish a new program along with a fun video every week, and it's called Thursday Learn Day. Community Programs Check out these programs created by the Sphero EDU user community. There is some pretty creative stuff in here as well. Activities Similar to the program sections, there are a few different ways to interact with activities. Sphero Activities In this section, you will find Sphero-made activities that can help you get started with Sphero and programming. We are always adding new content, so check back regularly. Many of the classroom activities are aligned to education standards. Community activities. There are hundreds of activities made by educators in the community. You can publish your own activities by creating them from the edu.sphero.com website. Workbook. The workbook keeps track of all the activities that you are working on. All teacher assigned activities will show up here as well. Assignments. Educators and parents will have an additional Assignments tab where they can review assignment progress, answers, and student-created programs. Drive. Here, you can freely drive your robot. Remember to aim first, ensuring the blue taillight on your robot faces you so it's properly oriented. Once you are finished with this video, tap the Mark Complete box below to track your progress through the steps.